for anyone at home who doesn't know about the carnivore diet, doesn't know what it is, what, what, how would you define that? Well, it's a diet that consists of hopefully just animal products, mostly of meat, but you want to aim for around 70% meat, 30% consisting of other products like eggs and cheese and like fish and things. Okay. Um, so who would want to adopt that kind of a diet? Everyone, if possible. Why is that? Because it's just food. It's just what you're supposed to eat. It's just what we've always eaten. It's not It's not really particularly a diet. It's just like eating right. Lifestyle. Awesome. Love it. Okay. Cool. So what have you noticed that most of your peers or people of your age demographic consume most of? What do you see their food habits? What are they like? Like lots of bread. I've noticed a lot of bread, like crisps. <laughs> Um, a lot, a lot of people have like chocolate bars and things in their lunches, or like cereal bars that like are supposed to be healthy but aren't. Also, I see a lot of like salads that aren't actually that good for you. Okay, uh, you're not actually a carnivore, but you have sort of gone in and out, like playing with the ketogenic diet. What carnivore foods do you enjoy that you include in your diet? I like bacon and eggs, and I eat a lot of cheese. Cool. And chicken. And what kind of keto-friendly foods do you incorporate? Cucumber and chicken and a lot of yogurt. Yogurt is really good, like just plain Greek yogurt. So when when do you do your cheat days? Then that's like when Thursday. it's Thursdays. Okay, cool. Um, but sometimes, so sometimes I'm pretty sure on your cheat days you pretty much just have eggs and bacon, which is kind of hilarious because that's not it's really cheating. It's like cheat absolutely <laughs> totally compatible on the carnivore diet. Certainly is on the ketogenic it's, diet. It's because I can't have it when. See, on a lot of weekdays, mum can't, doesn't have time to cook me the bacon and eggs, so then when it's Thursday and she's home, I'm like, can I have bacon and eggs? <laughs> <laughs> cool. I like pasta with cheese on it, and even though cheese is allowed in a carnivore diet, pasta kind of ruins it completely, so you can't really pair the two together and have it be carnivore. So I have cheese and pasta, I like pizzas occasionally, I have fruit juices a lot, which kind of sounds like it'd be healthy, but it isn't really, because the fruit is not... The, sometimes fine if it's like ketogenic friendly food or fruit but when you put it in the juicer even if there's no added sugar to it it takes away all of the fiber so that it, you're just remaining fructose and then it goes to your liver and it's like alcohol like it's like a poison wow okay so what would you say then to everybody that thinks fruit juice is healthy it's not <laughs> <laughs> so cut it well, out right it's unless great. unless it's thursday and then you can feel free to to enjoy it as a treat cool okay um, anything else? Like save your life. If you have like really bad illnesses, like when glucose feeds cancer cells and stuff, like it can really be beneficial for my health. Right. So it's a longer lifespan. Since we're hypercarnivores, if you want to do that, then you should focus on around seventy percent meat, 